Guys, here with Mick Shaw from CFX. Is that right? CFX, CrossFit FX in Cogra. Got Jason Hayward here with me as well. This bike here is the Men's Fit Bloke Challenge winner from last year. So if you remember that on the main stage, it's such a hit that we've actually relocated it to a 250 square metre arena, which is purpose built, three days of CrossFit activity. Oh, these guys are huge favour, let's be honest. They're putting the whole thing on. Massive job. You can rely on them all the way. So I'm going to get them to talk through now what you can expect to see when you come down as a visitor over the next three days. Hey, Mick, you want to go? Well, guys, what we've had so far this morning is a 30 20 10 rep of toes to bar, kettlebell swing, and box jumps. So a bit of variety. And then each athlete had to pump through 30 reps of each of those movements, then 20, then 10. The next workout that these guys are getting into now is three rounds of 15 chest to bar pull ups. So their chest has got to touch from forearm extension, then into nine power snatch at 50 kilos, so 35 for girls, then 50 double unders. They'll do three rounds of this. Then, as soon as they've finished this, within that 10 minute time cap, they've got to do a max weight thruster. That's a full front squat and press. Chase, pretty tough. Yeah, so basically we're looking at two workouts a day over the over the three day obviously weekend. So every athlete gets to do two workouts for today. Every athlete gets one workout tomorrow. Following that, the the top athletes are the only ones that proceed through the remainder of the weekend. So we do a cull the, through the back half of the day. It's the top tiered athletes that go through for the back of day two and then rolling into the beginning of, of day three. And then following that, we do a cull again, and it's only the the top seven athletes that proceed. Through through to the final. So come day to Sunday, day three, they should be quite tired, but nonetheless, it should be a pretty good showdown. We've got some great athletes in here, some, some top ranked regional athletes, and also some, um, some world class athletes. We've got Chad McKay, he came 14th in the 2010 World Games, and we've got Amanda Allen. She, what, what did Amanda come last year? Amanda Allen competed at the World Games last year and came third at our region. So yeah, we've got some class in there. You gotta say this to believe it. I mean, just watching it on the camera, it doesn't do it justice. This is a true spectacle. I mean, these bikes aren't that fit, as you can see. <laughs> it's the fittest of the fittest. I'm bullshitting there. Get down here. Three days of it. Can't wait to see you.